Welcome back to Surviving Mars, Inventive India. Last time around, I got a, a rare metals mining operation up over here, uh, and a dust storm came in. Uh, I'm still just on the edge, uh, because I need to get more uh, machine parts, and uh, it's uh, not going to happen until I get a... Uh, Uh, until I get uh, uh, until I get more um, resources online, and uh, uh, and this could be uh, a fairly uh, detrimental uh, situation here, uh, because without the uh, the metals or or the uh, uh, machine parts the uh, uh, wind turbines uh, don't spin so uh, you know they can't be maintained uh, but the dust storm ends uh, real soon now and that should be just soon enough that the uh, colonists don't get too uh, too badly off uh, Fortunately, we have uh, plenty of uh, food, uh, but we just need the solar power to come back online and uh, the uh, water production to stop leaking. Uh, right. Uh, okay, it stopped leaking. So... Uh, we got through that with uh, minimal fuss, uh, but I've got a probe here, and uh, I want to uh, deep scan uh, one of these uh, sectors. And I'm not sure which one. Um, if, if I deep scan in range of the dome, that might not be so bad. Um, yeah, uh, okay, so I'm going to deep scan here. No resources. Bugger. Um, okay. Uh, right. So I've got a moisture vaporator, uh, actually. I've got a uh, rocket that I can send out. Uh, which I'm going to send to Earth. Uh, I'm going to collect more tourists, probably. Uh, then, uh, now let's see here. Yeah, I'm going to run out of... Okay, mental breakdown. Yay. Right. Uh... Good. And that's because of the uh, lack of life support there. Uh, I'm going to collect more tourists. Uh, this rocket is uh, loading up with uh, rare metals. So there's that at least. Uh, right. So... Uh, what do... Yeah, I'm thinking, uh, I knew it was a bad idea to buy that, uh, that, um, uh, probe. I should have kept it for the, uh, uh, oh, right, I'm pretty sure I have a vaporator, so, uh, I do. So what I'm going to do is, uh, uh bring that. Uh, online over here and of course uh, connect that to the rest of the system uh, like so and like uh, where is it no it's under power uh, and a power cable and that uh, that should uh, 
should get uh, some of that stuff uh, uh, moving. Okay, so we'll get some more scanning going over there. Uh, I've got plenty of concrete. I can probably turn off the uh, concrete extractor, but uh, what I want to check here, hygroscopic coating, I'm going to make sure all of those have it. Uh, so that we can, uh, you know, produce more water. Since obviously uh, we need to rebuild our reserves because of that stupid Saint Elmo's fire mystery. Uh, right. And I think I need to. Uh, what am I researching? Rover Command AI. Right. So once Rover Command AI is researched, I'll automate the uh, transport and the explorer. And then there'll be less stuff we need to worry about. Uh, the rocket has made it to Earth. So, uh, that's a tourist. A tourist. Uh, two tourists. Three, four, five. Okay, so tourist, tourist, not tourist, tour, not tourist, not tourist, not, 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 tourist, 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 right? Four, five, five tourists, okay. Uh, launch. Okay, uh, I'm doing that because at the moment uh, tourists are about the only thing we can do uh, to get the uh, the funding up other than researching uh, wait a minute uh, this which is 6,000. You know what, I'm gonna take those out. I'm gonna put that next. Um, Right. Uh, okay, what's not working? Yeah. That's eh, because we don't have enough of these. Right. Yeah, this is... The, we're probably going to end up having to wait out the, uh, the research on that. Uh, I'm going to, uh, what's automated mode? Um, okay, we're going to maximize the, uh, the priority on that one. Sinkhole, yay! Um, out of curiosity, I want to try something here. Uh, where is it? Over here. Um, and it's here, and it's flattened, and our... Nope, you can't, uh... Uh, you can't uh, fill in the sinkholes. Well, isn't that annoying? Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, what I want to do here, uh, let's offer food and see if we get a machine parts offer. Um, nope. Uh, what if we offer metals? And, nope. Well, let's leave the food for machine parts offer up. Uh, and see if, uh, if anybody's, uh, willing to go for that. Oh, bugger!
Yeah. Oh, you can land. That'll get us a little bit of resources. Okay. Uh, what I should do here... No, I'll drop this to low priority. And uh, I definitely need this rocket to finish fueling. Uh, that's the uh, the critical bit, because then I can go back to Earth and grab a batch of uh, tourists, and that should be enough that I can get some more uh, uh, machine parts. As long as the rocket doesn't explode on the launch pad, because that would be seriously annoying. Um, right, there was an autosave. So this is the sort of thing that happens when you don't plan very well, and uh, I clearly have not planned very well. Uh, yeah, uh, so, you know, if you're going to play, play better than me. Uh, okay, ready for takeoff, launch, bugger! Uh, launch without risk of explosion. Okay. Uh, thank heavens we're an inventor uh, for this one. Uh, right. Now, uh, this one... Uh, okay. Well... What I should do is uh, put a rare metals depot over here and uh, wait, no, I already have one over there. No, I don't need that there. Um, what I should do is uh, Forbid exports on this one. And this one. Uh, maximize the uh, priority. Uh, both um, fuel refineries are down. Uh, well, actually, something I can do as a stopgap. Uh, first off, I'm going to... Uh, build some uh, solar panels uh, right and then I'm going to uh, do something controversial I'm going to uh, demolish these and see if that is enough to tide everything over. Uh, right. Uh, possibly. Uh, probably not. Okay, if I kill that, and I kill that one. Okay. So that will reduce the uh, machine parts maintenance load. And, yeah. Maybe that uh, will allow uh, things to operate better. But I've got a rocket over here. So if we get a passenger rocket, tourist, tourist, not tourist, 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 not, 
not, not, not, not, not, four, five. Right, so that's uh, five more tourists that I can uh, send to Mars. Okay, so that'll be enough to get five more uh, machine parts. Okay, so that got the fuel uh, refineries uh, brought back online. Uh, so, yeah, uh, what I need also is... Uh, to uh, create a couple more of these. They just take polymers and concrete, which we have. Okay. Uh, that should uh, that should help with that. That obviously is uh, stopped dead. Uh, but when this gets fueled up, finally, uh, we'll be able to uh, launch uh, launch that and get at least some uh, income from the rare metals that we got so far. Uh, Rover Command AI is at 74%, so I think we'll be able to get that before I need to manually send out for uh, metal collection with the uh, transport. Uh, is that's just a pain because I always forget to do it uh, so that uh, yeah I know there's low resources I'm working on it uh, right uh, okay um, yeah right okay so, uh, really, I'm just waiting for more tourists to arrive. Uh, five of them, I, as I recall. So, uh, that, uh, that means uh, I'll be able to uh, call in a, uh, a supply pod. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll do that immediately. Uh, the, the reason I'm not sure I'll do it immediately is uh, uh, simply uh, if I wait a little bit longer, I don't end up having to burn the supply pod for just one thing, right? Uh, but I might end up doing that anyway. Uh, just to get the rare metals uh, refinery back online. Uh, okay, so that's five colonists. Um, and there they go into the dome. Okay. Uh, now I just now the rockets need to refuel before I can do anything. So yeah, uh, what I should do though is uh, build a couple of uh, landing pads. So uh, I'll build one over here. Yeah. Uh, right, okay, so that means I have enough of them for, for my rockets. Uh, and that's uh, somewhat important. Right. Um, Okay, uh, what I really need, uh, once I have, uh, have the, um, um, funding situation sorted out, and the next, um, uh, research after this one will do that, uh, long enough that I can, uh, replenish supplies, uh, because I'm going to need to get, um, okay, what's not working? A wind turbine, concrete, rare metals, yeah. Um, right, so I'm going to need to get uh, a fair bit of, uh, of um, uh, infrastructure online 
uh, before I can uh, get things uh, going here. Uh, now, of course, uh, I'm currently in a waiting game. I can't actually do much of anything at the moment. Uh, although this rocket will be able to launch real soon now. And uh, that will uh, definitely help. Uh, right. Because then I'll be able to bring in a few more tourists, I think. Uh, I'm not completely sure on that. Uh, I just need the uh, fuel refineries to stay online long enough that uh, the, uh, the fuel uh, is uh, produced. Uh, I'm not sure it's going to is that my luck wouldn't be that good. Uh, now, it's perfectly uh, reasonable uh, to fail at this game. Uh, I've had a couple of colonies where I did. Uh, made a bad... Uh, a cold wave. Oh, that's going to be fun. Uh, okay, that's ready for takeoff. It can go. Uh, cold waves are a little bit better than uh, dust storms, though, because they don't cause uh, pipes and stuff to leak. Uh, so, uh, they do require more power, but... Uh, uh, okay, we had a sector scanned. Uh, and they don't block rockets from taking off and landing, so, you know, there's that, too. Uh, right. Uh, okay, so when the rocket gets to Earth, uh, we'll get some funding from uh, the rare metals. I can't remember what the funding rate is. Uh, rare metals, 24, and we have five of them. So, okay, so we'll be able to get uh, two lots of uh, uh, machine parts. Uh, that... I'm thinking will be the smart thing to do. Obviously. Uh, I'm going to put up a, uh, another uh, food storage, though. Um, right. Uh, food depot. Uh, shift over a bit. Okay. Food depot. Uh, uh, my goal is to have way more food than I need so my colonists don't starve. Uh, and since I've got productive uh, farms uh, going, then uh, I might as well uh, benefit from them, right? Uh, yeah, okay. Okay, so what do I have here for stored power? 3,200. Uh, so I've got... Uh, what am I drawing? Okay, so I think I've got enough batteries to... Well, maybe maybe not. I'll see what the demands are when the cold wave arrives. I uh, may have an issue there. I'll see how long the cold wave lasts, too. Uh, that, um, that can be... Uh, Inconvenient. I had one game where uh, a cold wave lasted eight sols. Yeah, it was that bad. Um, send an explorer. Uh, okay. Anomaly. Oh, well, where's the explorer? Explorer, scan anomaly. Okay. I don't have any anomalies up there. Okay. Yeah. Whoops. So we'll scan the anomaly, obviously. Uh, it seems like a perfectly reasonable thing to do. Uh, where's the explorer? Uh, okay, we got 120. Uh, so that's 220 on the, 
Okay, now let's go over here and look at a passenger rocket. Do we have any tourists? We have one, two, three, four, five. We have five tourists. Um, okay. Uh, yeah. Launch anyway. Uh, right. So that's 220. Uh, if we get up to 270, I should be able to get three lots of uh, machine parts. Uh, in a uh, supply pod, uh, and that would be uh, uh, terribly helpful uh, because uh, I've got uh, I've already got the uh, supply pod that I can fill up. So uh, right, uh, yeah. So let's uh, watch this, and oh my. Uh, we're draining power really fast here. Uh, what I'm going to do is build a. Uh, I'm going to build a couple more of these. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Now the reason for that is these batteries can only put out 20 uh, power. Uh, so. Uh, I need to make sure I have enough batteries that they can keep up with the power drain uh, overnight. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, specific opening. Um, Uh, let's send the explorer down. Uh, I have a feeling I should not have done that, but I did, so have to just live with it. Uh, this rocket is almost fueled. Uh, bring that one up to normal priority. Uh, that one should be fueled enough to launch uh, real soon now. Uh, right, and I'll launch it as soon as I can. There we go. Launch. Good. And then the uh, the other rocket, when it lands, should give me 50 million uh, funding. And uh, Rover Command AI should be uh, uh, sorted out uh, uh, real soon as well. Uh, right. Uh, oh boy, meteor storm. Uh, well... That's a great uh, a great way to uh, have excitement, uh, and of course uh, we're going to find uh, anomalies that we can't explore because I sent the explorer down a hole. Uh, right. Okay. So you can land. And then. See about getting uh, some uh, machine parts in. Okay, so some tourists are leaving. And we should. Okay, uh, now let's go over here. Supply pod, uh, machine parts. We can get 15 of them. Which we will do. Okay, and uh, Rover Command AI uh, has been completed. 
Uh, so the transport will get automated. Yes. Okay. Now what are we researching? Terraforming subsidies. Right, right, right. That is the uh, thing we definitely need. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, now with the uh, transport being automated, it will be collecting metals off the surface. And uh, that will be extraordinarily helpful. Uh, right. Uh, the cold wave has less than a saw left. So we're, uh... Okay, so... Okay, so we're doing okay. I'll, uh, land this over here. Uh, we got 24 million from the rocket arriving on Earth. Okay, we'll uh, salvage that. And now we should have a whole bunch of stuff getting fixed. Um, right. Uh, real soon now, we should get... Uh, resources up here to bring this back online. Um, right. There we go. We got something coming here. Oh, it's probably frozen now. Yeah, it should be frozen. Uh... So it won't be able to uh, start working till the uh, cold wave ends. Right. Right, right, right. That's the, uh, the major thing there. Uh, yeah. That's the thing about uh, cold waves is if a building stops working for more than a saw, uh, it just uh, it freezes and can't be... Uh, used again until it uh, thaws. Okay. Uh, meteor storm has a saw left. Uh, right. Okay, so I think we're probably not so bad off at the moment. Uh, that's 36 out of 50 on fuel. That's refueling fast over here. Oh, we got a St. Elmo's fire. Uh, we lost the, ro uh, the rover, the uh, explorer. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we got 2,500 uh, science, so uh, it probably was worth the sacrifice. Um, right, so we got two rockets. We got a rocket on Earth. So let's see, tourist, no, tourist, 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 no, tourist. Nope. 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 Uh, tourist. 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 That's a full rocket of tourists. Okay, launch. Launch anyway. Okay. 
Uh, the thing is, tourists don't need to be happy. Uh, that's uh, uh, a, a major uh, a point. And it uh, uh, looks like we're uh, running down on uh, polymers. Uh, and that's likely because of the battery construction. Uh, right. So... Uh, but on the upside, metals is uh, increasing, and uh, that's uh, definitely good. A meteor storm is going to end soon. Uh, we've got a fair truck left on uh, terraforming subsidies, but with 12 tourists coming, that's 120 uh, million on the... Uh, uh, the... Um, uh, uh, funding front and uh, I think we've just about got things to the point where uh, uh, where it's going to be uh, uh, functional right uh, what if I open up this this work shift or this uh, work spot uh, I don't have yeah, I don't have enough uh, colonists there, really. Uh, what I should do is uh, uh, build a second living complex here. Uh, yeah, uh, build a second living complex and then uh, drop a, uh, a uh, non... Uh, tourist rocket over there uh, I actually want shuttles uh, that that's uh, that's what I I really want but anyway I'm gonna launch that rocket and when these guys arrive I'll drop them down here and then I think that'll be the end of the part the um, uh, the meteor storm is over uh, we're going up on uh, metal storage so uh, we're good there. Okay, so the rocket's here. Uh, you can drop here. And I think... I think that's going to be it for this time around. Uh, 100 colonists. we got a 1,000 science for that. A milestone. Uh, we have... Five colonists leaving, 12 arriving. Right. Okay, that's 144 million in funding. You know what? I used to think tourism wasn't... Uh, this is our... Uh, let's see. A colonist died of old age. Okay. So that's the first colonist death, uh, and we're on Sol 70, so that's uh, that's not too bad. Uh, what I should do over here, right, um, yeah, yeah, if I get a uh, another batch of workers out, out here, uh, then uh, this, I can run it... Uh, three shifts potentially and that would uh, get more rare metals out uh, otherwise this one's almost ready to launch and when it is uh, I'll uh, send it back to earth uh, we have enough uh, resources to, or enough funding to grab some uh, uh, some other resources as well. So, uh, but I used to think tourism wasn't worth the bother, but uh, apparently, uh, it's not that. It, it's not a terrible um, stopgap if you're uh, in a bit of a fix. So, uh, there's that, I guess. Uh, I was wrong about tourism. Uh, sanity breakdown. Uh, 
uh, okay. Suggest seeking professional help. Uh, right. Uh, okay. Uh, we had, uh, our, uh, rocket arrive on Earth. Uh, this one is not ready to take off yet. And this one, nowhere close, but it's collecting rare metals. So, yeah. Uh, what I really, really want to do is get the resources together so I can build the Mohole Mine. But uh, apparently that's not going to happen anytime soon. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this time. Uh, so next time around, uh, more uh, filling around and waiting around and uh, trying to get things uh, uh, shifting along. And probably a few more steps in this uh, St. Elmo's Fire mystery, uh, which is definitely not helping things. Uh, okay, so that's all for this time. See you next time.